it's that time of week when I'm doing a quick fill-in grocery haul. Um, no fresh fruits and veggies waiting for my grandson before we go pick those up because it'll still be a couple of days. But I did stop by Aldi, so I have a couple of freezer items that I want to do first so I can get them in the freezer because it's hot as blazes today. Um, two frozen pizzas just to stick in there for next week. Then two small gluten-free ones for me. And two packages of ice cream sandwiches for the upcoming week for my daughter and grandson. And I'll show you everything else in a moment, but I want to put these things up real fast. So I'll be back in a second. Okay, my refrigerator items were pretty simple. They had a really good price on the shredded Mexican style cheese so I picked up some of this because my grandson does like quesadillas and they're a fallback one if you know I can't get him to really eat much of anything else and plus they're just fast so I grabbed some of that I grabbed four quick yogurts I like the key lime and the lemon meringue I actually eat these as dessert because they are way sweeter than what I usually buy and the only fresh fruit slash veggie slash anything fresh that I bought was a small watermelon for this weekend for my husband because like I said he you know he loves watermelon so I grabbed one of those and then on the pantry stuff I bought a couple of jars of Alfredo sauce I do like to make homemade but I just find it is so convenient to have some in the pantry and for some reason when I went to make chicken Alfredo this week I only had one jar and anytime I'm having um, my sister over because she really likes chicken alfredo, um, I use at least two jars. I was kind of bummed by, about that. So I grabbed some to put in the pantry. And Pop-Tarts, strawberry to stick in the pantry. Sorry guys, I didn't get this organized. I'm trying to put up as we go. So some, I bought two boxes of these. I have not tried these before, but the Cheesy Potato Southwest Dice. These are for my pantry food storage. And then two boxes of these cheesy hash brown potatoes. Um, we don't eat a ton of things like that, but I do like to have them on hand. Sometimes I need a quick pull together meal and to add you know diced ham and some veggies and things you can pull together a casserole really quickly that way and yeah i'm not really good inspired with my meals so that's that's working out pretty well doing quick things like that for me hot dog buns because we are going to have hot dogs this weekend that's on the menu plan a bottle of carolina red sweet muscadine wine this is by duplin wineries which is based here in North Carolina, in Rose Hill, North Carolina. This is actually for my husband and daughter. Um, I do not, cannot, because of um, a medication I take, I cannot drink wine. So I do like sweet wine, but I just can't have it. Um, pepperoni, because, you know, pepperoni is just good to have around. My daughter wanted some Kit Kats, so we grabbed some of those. And she requested that I grab her a box of the wild blueberry and the double chocolate muffin mixes to stick in the pantry. I think she's used up all of the ones we had. We have actually used up the last of our flour tortillas, the, the last huge package I bought from Sam's Club. So I bought two of these. Oh, one more refrigerator item, guys. Pizza, and this is for tonight, which is Friday night when I'm filming this. I don't think I'll get it up today, though. There's Chino trying to help me. Um, see, told you guys, he is my curiosity killed the cat kind of cat if ever there was one. We've moved him twice since I started filming this. But this pizza is for tonight's supper to go with movies. So that was my quick Aldi haul. I believe it came out to... $68.08 of all the weird odd numbers, but anyway, $68.08. So this is kind of just a tied over. A lot of it's pantry stuff, um, and I'll actually be picking up our regular groceries at some point this weekend. Thanks for watching, guys.